hello everyone in this video we will learn about paging what is paging why it is required in our system and how paging is performed in our system so let us start with the basic concepts of paging in our system we are having two different types of addresses either it is a logical address or we can say virtual address and second one is physical address so the address that is generated by a program is nothing but a logical address and this logical address forms the virtual address space whereas the address actually available on memory is known as physical address so these are the two different types of addresses and virtual address space is divided into fixed size partition that fixed size partition is known as pages let us take example suppose we are having this address space and this address space is divided into five equal fixed size partition these all the partitions are known as pages whereas the corresponding unit in the physical memory are called a page frame or we can say frame so suppose we are having this physical memory or we can say ram this memory is divided into fixed size partition and each partition is known as frames first frame second frame third frame fourth frame fifth frame and the page and the page frame are always of same size so we can say that the page size is equal to frame size now how the mapping is to be done means how the address space is mapped onto this ram here to map each and every pages onto these frames we need or we require a special data structure that is known as page table now let us see how the mapping is to be carried out here this page table is having five slots or we can say five index first second third fourth and fifth now to load this page one this page one will check at index first here at first index it point out to a third frame so this page is to be loaded into third frame so at here in third frame first page is to be loaded same way second page is loaded over in fifth frame same way third page is to be loaded into the first frame fourth page is to be loaded into the second frame and fifth page is to be loaded into the fourth frame so in this way by using this page table each and every page is to be loaded into the any one of these frames in the main memory so in this way each and every pages are to be loaded into memory whenever it is required in our most of the virtual memory system uses this technique that is known as paging so if we wants to define the paging then it is a memory management technique by which a computer retrieves data from the secondary storage that may be a hard disk or some other device and store in a main memory for the use in paging the operating system retrieves data from the secondary storage in the form of page and place the entire page in the frame means in the paging the operating system or memory management unit will retrieve the entire page and place that entire page into the memory in a particular frame and the size of address space may be a greater than that of main memory so in such case instead of loading the entire address space into the memory to run the process memory management unit copied only the required pages into the main memory which are required to execute that process or that program so in order to keep the track of pages and page frame os maintains a data structure the data structure is known as page table so in this way paging tactic is to be carried out in our system now we have already seen there are two types of addresses a there are logical address or physical address so here we need to convert your virtual address or we can say logical address into physical address so let us see how virtual address is to be converted into the physical address now this one is our virtual address space this virtual address space is divided into small parts or small partitions that partition is known as virtual page so we are having 11 virtual pages from 0 to some number and this one is the physical memory that is ram again this ram is divided into small partitions that is known as frame or we can say space frame 
here the size of this virtual page and virtual frame are of same that is of 4 kilobytes and this is nothing but a mapping of this page into this frame means this page is to be loaded into this frame and this process is to be done by a data structure that is known as page table so here in first page it points to a second frame so this page is to be loaded into second frame again this page points out to a first frame so this page is to be loaded into the first when the virtual memory is used the virtual address is present to a memory management unit that maps the virtual address onto the physical memory address now here we have a computer generated 16 bit address from 0 up to 44 kilobytes so this is nothing but a virtual addresses from 0 to 44 kilo now with 44 kb of virtual address space we get 11 virtual pages that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 so we get 11 virtual pages and 24 kb of memory if we consider this memory of 24 kb then we get 6 pages frame 1st 2nd 3rd 4th 5th and 6th and each of 4 kb size means this page frame are also of 4 kb and each and every frames are of 4 kb size because the size of frame as well as size of pages are same so here there are 11 pages and 6 frames now only 24 kb of physical memory is available we are having only 24 kb of memory so although 44 kb program can be returned they cannot be loaded into the memory in their entirely and run means we cannot load this entire program into this memory because the size of program is 44 kb and we have only 24 kb of physical memory so we cannot load this entire program into this memory because the size of memory is less than this virtual address space so in this case what we have to do a complete copy of program score image up to 44 kb must be present on the hard disk means this virtual space is there in hard disk only the required pages are to be loaded in the physical memory means pages that are required to execute the process can be loaded in the physical memory rest of the all the pages are there in the hard disk only so transfer between ram and hard disk are always in the unit of page means whatever the data that is transferred from this hard disk that is this virtual address space to this ram is always in the form of pages means the entire page is to be transferred from address space or we can say hard disk to ram now what is the internal operation of memory management unit to convert your virtual address into the physical address so here this one is nothing but a page table having 16 index from 0 to 15 these all are the values that is inside a page table and this one is a bit value either a 0 or 1 this one is the address that is generated by a program that is known as logical address we consider it is 8196 here this logical address is converted into two part first part is this one and second part is this one so this higher 4 bit this higher 4 bit will point out a virtual page so if we consider here 1 2 4 8 so its a value is 2 so this value will specify the virtual page this one is used as an index to this page table here the value is 2 so it points out to a second index in the page table then here at second index there is one value that is 1 1 0 so it will use this value 110 now here that is a bit that is a present or absent bit a value is either 1 or 0 so this value this 110 is to be copied here and this value is placed over here that is 110 so first three bit are the value of this page table that is 110 now this last 12 bit that is the offset 12 bit offset this 12 bit offset is copied directly from input to output so these 12 bits are placed as it is over here so in this way 
this logical address 8196 is converted into physical address that is 24518 so in this way your logical address or we can say is your virtual address is converted into the physical address first four bit that is the index of your page number so it's two so it points to this index second here the value is 110 this value is copied into the physical address and last 12 bit offset is copied as it is from input to output so by combining these two value you will get physical address now here we have present absent bit the value of this bit is either 0 or 1 now what the value 0 will indicate and what the value 1 will indicate if the value is 0 if the present absent bit is 0 it is a page fault that means a trip to operating system is caused to bring the required page into the memory means if the value is 0 then it indicate the operating system to bring that page into the main memory and if the value is 1 that means a required page is already there in main memory and page frame number found in a page table is copied to a higher order bit of the output register along with the offset so this is the difference where the present absent bit is either 0 or 1 together page frame number and the offset creates a physical address so physical address is equal to page frame number plus offset of your virtual address that is the 12 bit offset of your virtual address so in this way your virtual address or we can say logical address is converted into the physical address thank you very much